Ladies, gentlemen, it's MW3 Master, and I'm here with you with some of the best news I've ever seen. The best news. The best. Now, I kind of look stupid, but here, I'm going to tell you guys about some um, perks and killstreaks of MW3. And I. And uh, I am. Yeah, let's let's get this started. Now, perk one is going to be called extreme conditioning. Increase sprint time and pro climb objects faster. Pro is climb objects faster. Then there's going to be sleight of hand, as you always know. Faster weapon reloads and pro. This is different. Faster weapon swap, as you would know, steady aim would be that in Black Ops. Now, then there's scavenger. You know that too. And it's replenish ammo from dead dead bodies. And a pro is more ammo off spawn, which, that's a new one too, I, I kind of like that. Then there's Blind Eye, which I've never seen this one before. It's undetectable, undetectable by air support, and pro launchers lock on faster, do more damage to vehicles. It's Ghost Pro, guys! I can't believe it, it's Ghost. Did you know it was Ghost? Because I didn't know it was Ghost. And another thing is, it's it's called Recon. Now, this is such a freaking epic sounding. I don't even know. It's explosive damage marks target. Pro bullet damage marks target. And good for callouts. You know, guys, I'm not very, uh... I'm not very, um... I'm not very, uh, informed with that one. Guys, I'll have to get some more on that one. Okay, Hardline. One less kill. Point streak. Well, yeah. I mean, yeah. We all know that one. In pro two assist equals a kill towards a kill streak. Dude, do you know what this means? This means if you get two assists, then all you have to do is shoot someone once, and then shoot someone another time, then you get another kill. It's like another kill, guys. That's amazing. Then there's assassin. Assassin. I don't even know what to think. That is such an awesome name. Immune to UAV, portable radar, thermal, and heartbeat sensors. Now on MW2, that all has to be pro. It's just invisible to UAV. And then there's a uh, pro. In the pro, it's immune to CAU, CUAV, and EMP. Whoa. Oh, guys, you're immune to the U, to the EMP. Immune to a E M P. I don't even know anymore. This this I'm so excited, guys. So excited. Now, guys, this is such an epic. This is so epic. I mean, guys, it's amazing how awesome this is. But then there's uh, but then. There's a quick, there's overkill. Two primary attachment, attachments. And for pro, two attachments on your second primary. Two primary guns. You can have the M4A1 and an M21 EBR. Right now I'm referring to MW2. But M4A1 with a SCAR H. M16 with an AK-47, AK-74U with the AK-47. I don't know, guys. Right now, I feel like I'm such a white boy 7th Street because he, he's always happy in his videos. I mean, I'm not saying anything, but he's always happy. Now there's a quick draw. Faster aim, and there's pro, faster recovery from equipment and nade usage. Epic. But not my very favorite one. There's Blast Shield, Flak Jacket from Bops. Bops, I don't know. And immune to sun flashbangs. Oh! Black jacket from Black Ops. It's awesome. It's not even equipment anymore, as it was in MW2. And now, and then you're immune to sun and flashbangs? It's amazing, guys. I mean, it, I mean, the stun part, I don't know if if you're gonna still gonna be um, if you're still gonna be uh, slow moving, 
and still, um, and still, um, uh, uh, you can't hear from the flashes, but, um, yeah. Okay, there, here's another one. There's sit rep, you all know, attack from Black Ops, and then there's, in pro, you hear enemy footsteps louder, um, you know, I don't really think that's necessary, in my opinion. Okay, now there's Dead Silence. It's basically a ninja. It, dead Silence, ninja. And pro is no fall damage, which that would be in Commando, right? Yeah. And then there's a ooh, Stalker. Faster movement while aiming. And then there's pro. Delayed Claymores. You can deny Claymores, guys. You can deny the Claymores, but the thing is... How are you going to get up to it to where you can actually... You have to get behind it, or... I don't know, guys, but this is pretty cool. Okay, so... Yeah, I think the Stalker... On, um... Faster movement while aiming... I think that's pretty good, guys. I mean, you know, it's... it's you can't really move. No, oh, okay, okay. Marksman. ID targets from range. Identify targets from range. Now, I mean, I can always tell which team is which by the way they're dressed. And if they don't even have a green thing above them, but it's pretty cool. And then the pro longer breath hold in with your sniper rifle. Now, yeah, I, think I, I can see how that will go with Marksman. Okay, steady aim, guys. From Black Ops. Increased hip fire accuracy. Pro. Faster aiming after sprinting. That's stupid, guys. I'm, I'm just saying. Oh, okay. Kill streaks. Kill streaks. Three types. Don't let the dog in. Nope. Hey, Timmy11 is the password. Now, uh, now, um, this is for care packages. No. This is for care packages. There's a assault, support, and specialist. You pick up which type of class is which during class editing. Now here's assault, guys. Care package: four kills, no changes. IMS: five kills, three or four landmines that cannot be stunned or flashed. Eh, stupid. Predator missile: five kills, no changes, guys. Predator missile. Sentry gun. Five kills, no changes. Precision airstrike. Six kills, no changes. Attack helicopter. Seven kills, no changes. Little bird flock. What is this? Looney Tunes? Seven kills, little bird helicopters. Patrol the map. Possibility of a shooter in the helicopter. Little bird guard. Big helicopter that follows you around the map for protection. Oh my god. What is this? Dead Ops Arcade when you have that little bird that shoots everything? I don't even know. Okay, Reaper. Mortar team with five Predator missiles. Oh my god, nine kills. And for the little bird guard, nine kills. And for little bird flock, seven kills. But not Reaper? I don't know. I don't even know anymore. Talon. Robotic tank like home front. Tanks! They're gonna have tanks! Robot tanks! They're gonna have tanks! They're gonna have tanks! Oh, guess what? You loved the AC 130 in MW2. Now they have it in MW3. 12 kills. Same as MW2. Control AC 130. Pavlo, 12 kills, same as MW2. Juggernaut armor. Ooh, Juggernaut here. Uh, what are we doing? Referring to MW Black Ops? Become a Juggernaut from Spec Ops. Aren't those like headshots only, guys? Okay, and then there's Osprey Chopper Gunner, 15 kills. Jump into a Chopper Gunner. Jump into a Chopper Gunner and drops four care packages for your team. That's actually pretty good. I mean, it drops four care pack packages for your team. Then there's, yeah, Juggernaut Armor is tw 15 kills. Halo 12 kills, yeah, 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 okay. 
Now here's support guys on the kill streaks list. UAV four kills no changes. Counter UAV five kills no changes. Ballistic duffel. Ballistic duffel bag. Ballistic duffel case. I don't know. Ballistic duffel five kills. Give your team a give your team jug gives your team juggernaut so player health is increased to 130. That's amazing guys. I don't even know. Hacked care packages. Don't need Hacker Pro anymore. Now, you can have hacked care packages that explode. Only five kills. Sam turret, eight kills. Oh, it's a Sam turret. Remote UAV, ten kills. Possible, controllable UAV with the ability to fire missiles and guns. It's an AC-130 that leaves you vulnerable on the ground while it goes around and pounds everything. Advanced UAV, 12 kills. Oh, it's a Blackbird. It's a Blackbird. Remote turret. Sentry gun that you can control. I love this game. Stealth Bomber, 14 kills. EMP, 18 kills. Juggernaut armor, 18 kills. Care package that contains Juggernaut. Yeah, 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 yeah. Escort airdrop, 18 kills, same as Osprey except computer controls the chopper gunner and still drops four care packages. Pretty cool, pretty cool. You know, guys, I really wish that, you know, you could have like, that you could, um, that you have an emergency airdrop. I mean, you know, guys, that'd be awesome. Okay, extra perk for two kills, extra perk for four kills, and another extra perk for six kills. Now, here's a death streak. Oh, death streaks again, I'm saying. Mm -hmm. Juice, lightweight, four deaths. Marty, Marty Dom, same as previous games for four deaths. Final stand, same as old games. Don't know if you stand back up. I hope you stand back up. Uh, revenge, person that, that last killed you appears as permanent dot on radar that till kill. Sweet. Stopping power. Last for one kill. Five deaths. Dead man's hand. Run around with C4 in your hand and suicide bomb. Oh my god. Now, needless to say, there's a huge amount of information to feast upon with this apparent leak. What are your thoughts regarding and leak different perks of killstreaks being listed? Do you think that one perk will allow players to have a direct advantage against players using a different perk? What do you think that that the perks are balanced perfectly? What about the different kill streaks? Do you think that the kill streaks are balanced, or that some of your kill streaks were kill streaks appear to require not enough kills? You know, just comment below and share your opinion, guys. Now, I really like this. Well, really cool to really cool to find. It'll be kind of annoying getting used to new names or perks, but Hacker now will be calling Sitrept, but everything looks impressive. I'm really interested to see how the assault, support, and specialist things worked out. I can't wait to guys. Well, hope you like my video. MW3 Master, subscribe, comment, and rate. Goodbye.